The last remedy is the muscle balm. So aches and pains in your joints, in your muscles, you're gonna to wanna to use this balm. It is a soothing, it has a warming sensation that is gonna give you relief. I would recommend if you have super sensitive skin, once again, you probably know if you have sensitive skin, you can pair it with coconut oil to kind of tame down the um, warmness that wherever you apply this will, it, I mean, it's trying to soothe, it's an anti-inflammatory, so it has that warming sensation. If that's too much for you, pair it with some coconut oil. All you need to do, like every other balm, uh, I'm gonna apply for right here to my neck. I always get a little tension up in here, so I'm just rubbing and then I'm going to just kind of massage it in. Um, a little goes a long way, like the rest of our balms. I will recommend after I rub this in, oh, and I got a crack, how about that? Um, I'm gonna wash my hands because our muscle balm has some chili in it and it's a very rare form of chili and a powerful form of chili. And so I'm gonna wash my hands because I wanna be very careful about what I touch after I use the muscle balm. So do not put your hands in your eyes, on your face, anywhere else on your body. Once again, it has a soothing, warm relief power that you obviously wanna to apply to your joints and your aches and your pains, but you don't wanna apply it anywhere else. So I'm gonna wash my hands right away, okay? Just note to self. Um, also, once again, to dilute it, if your skin is super sensitive and it's a little too warm, just then rub a little bit of coconut oil on over top and it'll help with that burning sensation. If once again, it's too strong for you. I think it's amazing. It smells amazing. It doesn't smell like some of the other scents that I've um, definitely experienced in some of those, those balms that try to ache your, relieve your aches and pains. So try out the muscle balm. It is amazing.